So I'm an F-18. He's in JF-17 right now. Setting up my cockpit real quick. I think our skills are pretty evenly matched, which means we're like beginner intermediates. So I think over here... Uh, so, you know, the thing of Fox 2 fights is you, you want to stay close so he can't get one off of you. You actually, it's almost like a scissors fight where you want to go slow. At least that's what you do when you're an F-18. So I'm going to pull vertical here. my nose around come on I'm still I'm going a little bit too fast to do what I wanted to do as you can see we're you know, we're real close um, it's really hard for a JF to get a gun kill which is the only reason I'm probably alive over there and I'm going way too fast here he's got a missile off okay flare 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 I'm still on afterburner I, sh I don't know why I didn't come off Another one. Okay, so now he's got two missiles off. So he doesn't have any Fox 2s left. I need to slow down a little bit. So I pull vertical. Almost blacking out. He's staying on my tail nicely. I'm not sure what kind of nodes authority the JF has. Altitude. Altitude. What I do know is DF-18, so I'm trying to bleed off speed here, get him to overshoot, but he landed a hit on me right there. Lucky. Using rudder turn here. I'm not very good at the rudder turns, but F-18 could have do some crazy things if you know how to use it right. So I lost him now. I don't know where he is. Yeah, I'm not sure how good the nose authority on the JF is, but um, F-18 could operate it on the deck. So I got a spike from him. There he is. He must have overshot me and come around me already. So I'm going for a stall here. Hopefully I can get my missile shot because I'm real slow. Doesn't track. Altitude. Too close. Altitude. Now I'm too slow to maneuver. I just want to get my... That's another rudder turn. Useful in situations like this. That could have been a missile shot if he didn't hit the water. That would have been a beautiful missile shot. I'm hesitant to count that as a win because I'm... Um, I think I just got lucky in surviving that gunshot. God, I love dog fights. I had so much fun. I'm trying to remember what I did here, but I'm tr I'm coming in slower. No, I'm speeding up. 400 knots. Remember, unlike a guns fight. You care a little bit less about how much energy you have left after the merge. You, a lot of times you're just trying to get the nose pointed around. Of course, if you're going slower, you know, he's going to come ahead of you, so... So... That's not going to be a missile shot, so I don't fire. I dump my nose, get some speed back. I'm trying to come, come around where he's going to come down. Lost visual, even though I saw I saw him as I'm recording this video. There he is. One of the gunshot, doing tiny little jinx. Altitude. But I'm basically Altitude. counting on the fact that he can't really shoot very well in that JF-17. Starting to let my speed build up too much. So I'm So I'm trying to set up a rate right here, but now I'm too slow. Just dump my nose a little bit. He's coming around, but as, I speed pick, as my speed picks up, I should be able to pick up right, the right here. We both almost hit the ground. If I didn't, he would have be been on my tail, and I think 
that could have been a missile shot on his part. But we make the same mistake. Half a mile. Mm, too close for a missile shot. I'm not sure if I go for it. I do, and I miss. That wasn't going to hit, even if he didn't have a flares. Okay, so I bled, bled off too much energy for that shot. And I think he pulled hard to avoid my missile, which lets me come back around on his tail. Half a mile. I know I'm not going to hit him, so guns. I'm also really bad at shooting. Should have kept turning there. I spent a lot of energy on that. Another Fox 2 hits the water. I've never seen this happen where I fly through a plume of water. In real life, I don't know what would happen going through water at 200 knots. Yeah, that's something I never accounted for, that my missile would just... Oh man, I wish I had some Fox 2s left here. That my missile would just hit the water. So, but, but, I'm on his tail. I'm gonna let him lead a little bit so I can get a more better pursuit, but he turns into me. Using gravity to get my nose turned around. I'm still on his tail. I'm gonna, tr I'm gonna go for a shot here. And I hit him. Yes. He just crossed my nose. Although most of the times when people cross my nose, I don't really hit him. Because I'm so bad. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit better at it though. I think this is where I'm going to try something silly. So my plan is... No, this is not the fight. Oh. I'm going to try to enter just under 400 knots. So get my nose pointed at him quicker. And see if I can kill him after one turn after the merge. Here we go. Flight controlled. Flight controlled. He's doing the exact same thing though. 0.6 mile. Fox 2. Doesn't track. Alright, so now we got a dogfight. We're both going very slow. We're in a sort of vertical scissors here. He's winning it. Altitude. Altitude. Fortunately, he's in a JF. So I'm going to continue this and try to take this fight to the deck and raid fight him. Like I said, the Hornet does raid fight a little bit better, but he's um, kind of inside my circle right now. He's going to get some rounds off. I offset so he misses. I'm going to keep turning. Geometry will eventually sort itself out. Building up speed a little bit. Same thing's going to happen. I'm going vertical so he has, hopefully has trouble pulling up his nose. And he does. That cost him energy. So I'm going to sit sweet, sweet and nicely around. But he's gravity to get his nose pointed at me. But very short opportunity. So just keep turning and turning. I'll get around him. I know this seems low, but he's even slower, so I'm using that. Uh-oh. I made... So I had a fight in the bag and I messed up. We're laughing about it on the chat. Because he did that earlier. I would have killed him anyways with my Fox too. So I think this is the fight where I try something really silly. Now I think I'm actually a little bit better at BVR. Yeah, exactly as I said. I'm going to blast by him and see what happens. I think I'm a little bit better at... BVR than I am um, with dog fighting, so I'm just gonna fly straight past him. And I don't think his Fox 2s can catch up. So let's, and then I'm gonna let him run out of Fox 2s, build even more distance, and turn around and kill him. So I'm Mach 1.1. Pretend to pull up, let's trick him into turning hard. And I'm just gonna keep going. Right. He's got a missile off. I got my flares out. And I'm going up and down just a little bit. Second missile off. Just to make make it make the missile bleed some energy. Well, he doesn't have any Fox 2s left. And I'm really far away. So I'm going to go for it. 
And he can't follow me up here because his thrust to weight is just a tad bit lower than mine. Not by much. Oh man, that barely hit him, but it did. Just remember, fighting the JF and the Hornet, I think a raid fight on the deck is like a textbook, more surefire way to win. I'm gonna try to carry, carry a little bit more energy here and see what happens. And you sort of fi figure out each other's habits, and so each dogfight, we're like adjusting to it. Merge. He's coming diagonal, I'm going pure vertical. I'm going nose pointed at him. Too close. But I got a Fox 2 off. Of course, that doesn't hit him. I think about 0.7 miles is the closest you can be in a head-on like that and expect it to hit. It's coming around my tail. He's going really slow. I am too. Altitude. I'm Altitude. Nah. I'm not sure if I follow him up. And now my SA is destroyed. I lost visual on him. It pretty much means I lost the fight. I, it's right on my tail. Let's see if I can pick up some... Sp uh, and somehow none of those hit me. And this is a fox too. He's a little bit... Way too close for a fox to hit. Try the same thing to get him to overshoot, and he lands a hit on me. I can't tell if that's a fox too or a uh, gun skill. I guess I could go back in the video and see. But that was a very nice kill from him. He got him right up when I reversed my turn. That must have been a fox too. The way my plane blew up like that. If I'd continue my turn, his missile wouldn't have hit me, instead of reversing it. Reversing a turn is so risky. Coming in faster this time. So uh, I changed my mind, slowed down a little bit. I figured a big scope circle is just going to make me a Fox 2 target. So he decides to tr reverse his turn and go that's for a, a, a one circle, and I think that's a mistake. Gives me way, way too much distance. Almost a mile. The one doesn't track. Almost got me a gun solution. Altitude. Altitude. Now we're in vertical scissors. I'm right at my rate speed now. A bit slow, so I dumped my nose just a tad bit. Now I'm going too fast. If I just stay here and keep turning, I'll get him. Hi, yo-yo. See if I can change the geometry a little bit. That's going to cost me. We're in a staggered circle here now. He must have almost hit the ground too there. 0.6 miles, let's see if I can make it, lead it a little bit. Couldn't kill. Nice. That was pretty cool. No, he's still there. No, he's not. <laughs> that was pretty cool switching from missiles to guns. And he just said cool. Now he had switched to an F-15C and I had no idea. A good F-16C pilot could do some crazy things. I've seen some do, do some things that look like it'll defy gravity or defy the laws of physics. I'm trying to go real slow and see if I can almost stall out. Put my nose around and get him.
So I'm going to try to go real slow here. Basically, if I don't make this missile shot, I'm dead. Unless he messes up too. We're both at a level where we both mess up quite frequently. So I started to merge at just under 400. 200 knots, 0.6 miles. Bam. So even if you're in close like that, if um, if your nose is pointed right, you know you get your nose around faster, and he's coming into your nose, your missile could often make the shot. Well, that was really fun. I know this is a sailing channel. <laughs> I know a lot of dogfights in here, but um, uh, sailing's gonna come back. Sailing will come back. But this is what I've been doing so far.